Hello, welcome to my channel. Firstly, I'd like to apologize for the Wednesday that passed us and we didn't put up a recipe, but that recipe will definitely come up in this coming Wednesday, which was going to be our scones made in our hair fryer. Today, I'm going to make a very interesting recipe, which is a creamy mussels hot pot. The amount that I'm going to make is going to serve two. You can also serve it as starters or a main course, but you can adjust the amount that you want to make. Today, we are not going to prepare too much because Pranesh is allergic to shellfish. For my ingredients, I have 400 grams of mussels with the shell which I rinsed out thoroughly. We bought this frozen and cleaned from the shop. I'm going to use a splash of olive oil. I've got one onions that I grated. I've got one stem of leek that I'm going to chop out. I'm going to use three cloves of garlic, which I'm going to crush, and a little bit of fresh thyme. And then to garnish, I have some spring onions. This recipe calls for some wine. So I'm going to use one third of a cup of white wine. I have here a cup of coconut milk and a cup of coconut cream, but you can substitute your cream for fresh cream, but using one cup. A grain of salt, a grain of pepper, a sprinkle of paprika and also for garnishing I have parsley which I'm going to use two tablespoons after cutting. We are going to serve it with a crusty bread which we're using a French loaf. I am ready to start braising and this is one quick recipe. I've got my heat on medium and I'm just going to add in a splash of olive oil to the pan. I'll allow this oil to heat up a little. My oil has heated up. I'm just going to add in my onions. I'll allow this onions to fry till it's soft. I'm just going to add in my leek to my onions. Give this a nice mix. Thereafter, I'm going to put in my garlic and my thyme. To the fried onions, I am going to give a grain of black pepper and a grain of salt. And also a sprinkle of paprika. Now I'm ready to place in my mussels. I give this a nice mix. I am adding in my wine and I'm going to lower my heat and allow the alcohol to cook out of my wine. Five minutes has passed and I'm ready to add in my coconut creams. And I'll also increase my heat a little. 
I added one cup of my coconut milk and now I'm going to add in my one cup of coconut cream. I'll give it a nice thick finish. I'll just mix this around and allow this to come to the simmer. My mussels has come to a slow simmer. I'm just going to put the lid on and give it five more minutes. Five minutes has passed and this is done. We had to leave some liquid to use our bread to soak up. Now I'm just going to garnish with the parsley and with the shallots. Put this switch the stove off. Now I'm ready to serve. There you go, your lovely, rich, creamy mussels served with a nice crispy French loaf to soak up the gravy wood. This mussels bring me very fond, fond memories because when living in Cizela, we used to pick this mussels from the rock when the tides were low. We lived quite close to the beach and we used to bring it, put it in a big pot without no water and put it over the heat where it used to boil and thereafter the water used to release from the mussel and the shell used to crack open. And those shells that never used to crack open, we used to throw them away because they were dead. The shells that cracked open, we used to release the mussels from inside and clean them and rinse it thoroughly and make a spicy chutney and place them in. There used to be one lovely meal that we used to enjoy. I hope you'll give this one a try which is a little different and quicker and easy. Thank you all for watching and enjoy.